Today's breakfast is oatmeal. Okay. The sun has not come up yet, but I need to go let the geese out. I figure it's bright enough out here. I can see where I'm going. So Erica had to go to class. She asked me to let her geese out. I said, sure, why not? <laughs> Actually, that's not what I said. Okay, so as you can see, I'm just wearing a sweater this morning. It's a bit warmer. The snow is melting. Maybe it will melt away. <sighs> it was 32 degrees. I think it's supposed to... Oh, I can't remember what it's supposed to get up to today. But I can definitely feel the difference, and there's no... No wind, no wind at all. Oh, I hear the geese. They heard me. Okay. Here we go. Put a little pressure on the door so it will swing open. Now, I have to be prepared. See how angry they are with me. It's early this morning. I shouldn't be too angry with me. Right, guys? Okay. Oh. Here we go. Oh. Not angry at all. Oh. Come on, Samson. They weren't angry at all. I'll show you. Hi, guys. Yeah, it's kind of dark out here. Can't really see too much. Come on, Samson. We don't have time to go for a walk today. Yeah, no time to take him out on the trail. One of the kids will have to do it later. Or he's just going to take himself for a walk. I think that's what it's going to be. Samson and Piper, she's already gone off on her own. Okay, let me clarify. There's not a whole... Oh, there she is. They're, they can't go far. And they don't go far. So he's okay. And she's okay, but she's just right ahead of me now. <laughs> okay, you know, I'm so sorry. It's this busy time of... Whoa, oh, I'm sliding on the ice. Busy, busy time of the year. Oh, he's coming. I hope to get something good recorded for you today. The only other, it might just be letting the geese out and then going back and locking them up tonight. But I'll have something for you. Come on, Sammy boy. Or maybe Samson trudging through the woods. Hey, come. He's like, oh, she means business now. They're like kids. Look at that. Hi, big boy. Just walk right on past me. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go in and eat my breakfast. I started some oatmeal before I came out here. Now i got to go back in and eat it. Look at this. I've gone back to my old boots. See, they're coming apart right here. Because the new boots I got are probably my regular size, but in the winter, look at how dirty the ground is now that the snow's melting. In the winter, I wear heavy socks and then my toes are right at the tip. And these have room in the toes. Yesterday, when I wore my boots all day, my toes hurt. You ever have that problem? Anyway, maybe I'll see if I can find a pair like these. They've been really nice until they came apart. <laughs> So today's breakfast. Let me see if I can hold it up. Today's breakfast is oatmeal. I used one third cup of old fashioned oats, a cup of water, some stevia to sweeten it, a pinch of salt, and sliced bananas on the top. Yes, this is today's breakfast. A T H M E, in case you follow that plan. Anyway. <laughs> Enjoy your day. Ah. We're at the library. Eric is down there looking at movies. Sorry, I got really close. But now you probably can't hear me. I got a book from the teen section. It's a time travel book. Free books as they're going through their collection. I think.
We're back home again. Now, on the way home, we stopped at Dairy Queen. Do you know how much a medium blizzard costs these days? I'll tell you. $5.08. Someone just let the dogs out. Hey, it's me. You don't need to bark at me. You don't need to bark at me. Hello, Piper. Hello, Sam. They're just a little excited. Hello, Sammy boy. Just a little excited that I'm home. <laughs> How much are medium blizzards in your neck of the woods? What you doing there? Hello. Hi. Five dollars and eight cents. And that was for a medium. I think you can tell I rarely go to Dairy Queen. <laughs> hey, what you barking at, the dog? Can't see her. She's back there. Okay. Oh yeah. So I don't know. It's um, I think it's after eight. Yeah, because we went to Goodwill and they close at eight. They kicked us out of the store. <laughs> we had about fifteen minutes there. That's all we needed. Uh, what did we get there? A book. Elisa got a book. I don't know what it was called, but she said it was a good floppy book, and she held it, and the pages just kind of flop back and forth. So then she handed the book to me, and yeah, it was a good floppy book. And it's pretty warm out here. I don't know what the temperature is, but it's not cold. And now I'm going to go home. I mean, I am home. I'm going to go in the house and take this scratchy hat off my head. And I think I need to line it with something or just stop wearing it altogether. <laughs> okay, if I don't talk to you to... I can't even talk now. If I don't talk to you again tonight... Have a great night and I'll see you tomorrow.